Hey everyone, so I'm going to do the Christmas tag ready for Christmas. Um, I just tried to film it a few minutes ago, but that didn't work, so I'm going to try this again. He just fell asleep, so I'm going to leave him here so that he sees asleep during this video. Okay, um, and I got this tag from the 411 Mamas. Um, the first question is, what's your favorite holiday movie? Um, I love all the holiday movies, um, but I love the Home Alones. I'm, they're just such a classic and they go back so much. And I haven't watched them this year and this actually made me think of it. I was like, oh my god, I need to watch them. So I'm going to put that on my to-do list of um, movies to watch soon. So I definitely love them because they're just a classic. reminds me of when I was a child. Um, what's your favorite uh, favorite Christmas color? I guess out of red and green. I don't know, but red. Um, I'm not a colors person. I'm very into blacks and stuff. So just painted my nails red for the holiday season, so that's exciting. So I would say red. Uh, do you like to stay in your PJs or dress up for Christmas? Um, I definitely like to stay in my PJs, and I make sure to buy new Christmas PJs every year. So now with Phoenix, I want to start a tradition of um, when the family comes over, because it's our immediate family, like my mother-in-law, my sister-in-law, my aunt, um, my sister-in-law's boyfriend, that come on Christmas Day. Because in our family, we celebrate um, Christmas Eve with my family and then Christmas Day with my husband's family. So I want to start a tradition of coming in our PJs and just kind of relaxing in our PJs. Um, for the most part, I um, I stay in my PJs because everybody comes here. So, and it's just like a chill out type of day. So Phoenix will be in his PJs the whole day on Christmas. So definitely when he gets a little bigger, maybe the next year I'll start that tradition of just kind of hanging out in our PJs and playing with his toys, you know. That'd be fun. Do, oh, that was three. Four. If you could buy, only buy one present, one person a present this year, who would it be? Hands down, obviously, no doubt about it, it would be Phoenix. I mean, if any year for it to be easy um, to choose one person, it's definitely this year. Um, we practically only bought him gifts this year. We didn't, me and my husband didn't make our exchange of gifts this year. We're focusing strictly on him, and we didn't go too crazy because he's little, and he doesn't need a lot of stuff, and everybody else got him a lot of stuff. So we're kind of, you know, just got him, you know, a handful of stuff just so that he has the memories and, and stuff of his first Christmas because it's very exciting that it's his first Christmas. Um, do you open your presents on Christmas Eve or Christmas morning? Definitely Christmas morning. When I was younger, um, we always did one gift on Christmas Eve and then the rest on Christmas morning. But once I got a little bit older, um, where I started working and giving gifts back, um, I never opened my gifts on Christmas Eve. And my mom would get so upset. When she was alive. She was like, hey, come on, open them, open them, let's see, open it already. And I'm, I'm like, no, I'll open them tomorrow morning. So... I wouldn't let them open it because I bought until the morning. So then, the only sucky part was that in the morning, everybody was like knocked out. Nobody wants to wake up. So they all opened their games practically. And I had to like wait around because I was like up super early. But I'm definitely, definitely, definitely going to stay with the Christmas morning tradition. And um, I'll probably do one on Christmas Eve um, for Phoenix. And it will probably be his Christmas pajamas to put on that night. Um, but other than that, I definitely, even now, the year, past years with my husband. I just like Christmas morning and I see it as in, you know, if you open Christmas Eve, open it or whatever it is, you can't play with it. Like, even if it's a new contraption, whatever it is, you can't enjoy it until, because you have to go to sleep. So, <laughs> I like that you can wake up and just enjoy all your gifts all day. Um, have you ever built a gingerbread house? Yes, I built one. Um, all past years that when I worked with my classroom, I used to build it with my classroom every year, and it was really fun because they really enjoyed it. Even though they were too little, but I would kind of try to include them as much as possible. And it was just cute to see the finished product, so I'm very much looking forward to doing gingerbread houses with Phoenix. Um, this year I didn't do one, but once he's maybe next year, we'll start the tradition of um, doing one all every year. And I'm very much for traditions, so it's like, Everything can be a new tradition. My husband's like, everything becomes a tradition with you. And yes, that's true. <laughs> um, 
um, what do you like to do on your Christmas break? Um, uh, relax and just enjoy, you know, the holidays and the extra food and all that good stuff. Um, any Christmas wishes? I just wish that everyone has, you know, um, a good holiday season. Um, it's all the tragedy that's going on, I know it's affected, affected everyone, and you know, it's just, it's sad, and it makes everybody's holiday just a little sad, because your heart goes out to those people, and it's hard to, you know, if, if anything, it makes you appreciate everything that much more, but I just wish that those people can have just a little bit of, of peace in their, in their hearts, because it's very hard, especially around the holiday season. Favorite Christmas smell? Um, my favorite Christmas smell would be anything pine cone-ish and like um, like that tree type of smell. And I actually haven't gotten a candle this year um, with that smell. I always forget, but I'm definitely, definitely gonna go pick one up because I just love having that smell and like that. Also, the pumpkin spice type of smell. I also like that one a lot. Um, all year round, I have like that gingerbread smell. I actually have them on my um, mantle top um, all year. So I love the gingerbread smell, but that's an all year kind of smell. The piney smell, I just kind of do around this, this season. Favorite Christmas meal or treat? I wouldn't say I have a favorite Christmas meal or treat. I can't really think of one. But uh, what I like food wise around the Christmas season is. Um, just all the pies and desserts, like, just that in general is what I like about Christmas season. Like, seeing our family and just having that, like, delicious dessert everybody makes, you know. So, I can't really pick one type of meal or dessert. I guess what I do like about this season are all, like, the pumpkin um, things that came out from Thanksgiving, like the pies, you know, like, and just pumpkin flavored stuff, which like, my new um, discovery this year. But other than that, just I like it all <laughs> for the Christmas season. But um, yeah, so that's about it. It was 10 questions, and I tag anybody who wants to do this, and I look forward to seeing your, your tags and your videos. So leave the video response below, and don't forget to subscribe up above. And thank you guys for watching. Happy holidays.